Well, I decided to share a few things that, well, it's a test share is what it is because I've never done this before sharing a screen. But I was reading here on Twitter what Joe Rogan just said about the Prime Minister of Canada, and I absolutely loved it. I thought maybe you'd want to hear it yourself. So here it is. Canada is communist. Canada's crazy. They're fucked. They're fucked. They got to get rid of that guy. How much time does he have? I feel like he's been prime minister for a while. Am I wrong? I don't know. I don't know how their system works up there. I have zero understanding of their system. Yeah. I never looked into it at all. I just, I didn't even, I I liked him. I liked him before the pandemic. Trudeau? Yeah. Yeah. I was like, he's a handsome guy. Yeah. Seems sweet. Yeah. You know, it's like good, good looking guy, confident, good talker. Yeah. And then during the pandemic, I'm like, oh, you're a fucking dictator. Yeah. Oh, you don't like criticism. You're trying to shut down criticism by saying that all your critics are misogynists and racists. That's exactly what he was doing. Joe, Joe got it down to the bone, man. He got it right down to the nitty gritty. Yeah. You hear he said that about the trucking people, the truckers? He called them. Called them all misogynists and racists. Oof. Yeah, he's gross. He's a He is gross. This man is a poor excuse for a human being. A sketchy guy. Yeah. And he's got some fucking shaky deals. I, I, you, if I said that, they would take me right off of YouTube. I would like to see, like, where the money is coming from. Like, why Why do you want everybody to get injected every four months? They don't need that anymore. Like, what are we doing? What are you doing? You can't even get into Canada unless you're vaccinated. Can't get in? No. Make sure that's true. Because someone just told me, Whitney just told me, she wanted to, she had to show her fucking vaccination card to get into Canada. That seems... It's... Well, it's not only that. Now they got this uh, Canada app thing going on, where where they where you're forced to take to uh, download it this app on your cell phone, and uh, if you don't, you get a five thousand dollar fine. <clears throat> and to top it off, the elderly, most of them don't even know how to use a cell phone, don't even have one, and yet alone to download it. But they say if you don't have, it, you get a five thousand dollar fine or you won't be allowed into the country or out of the country unless you put it on your cell phone. Now, that's not a pass or confirmation of a jab. That is total tracking. It's a little like it adds up for it's the, old. Yeah. Like this is where it's 2022. It's not 2019. You know where it, it still feels um, cuz I think things sway there so aggressively when thing when something happens. Um, where it feels like you're like, wait, what time is it right now? Is in New York. I was just in New York. Oh, yeah. Everywhere. Everyone was masked up everywhere. I was like, what's going on? Why yeah. are everyone still masked up? There's speaking of New York, they just actually what less than a week ago, they brought back the mask mandates. And so did California, or at least trying to. Now, Canada is going to be next, probably in Quebec first before it hits Ontario, I think. But anyway, let's continue with this Joe Rogan report scared we live here it's a different place like everybody here said well i hope i don't get sick take yeah. care of yourself do your best get medicine if you get sick yeah but new york is it, it was strange i was there two weeks ago it's bizarre yeah it's very bizarre it's very well we're not going to continue with this much further but this in my humble opinion is the real virus right there this guy right there he's threatening canada that's <laughs> There's no ifs and ands or buts about it. That's the guy who's doing all the fucking problems. And this is how this prick looks like right now. How do you like them apples? Who does he look like? Who does he look like? From Dumb and Dumber, right? That's exactly what he looks like. What's his name there? That Canadian actor, Dumb and Dumber. Anyway, I'm not going to continue on. I'm just going to leave this the way it is and let people see it for themselves. On behalf of everyone, till next time, have a great day.